Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. It's uh, Twixmas. Twixmas, they call it on the national holidays trips anyway when you book a holiday between Christmas and New Year, it's Twixmas. Mm -hmm. Something to do with betwixt, between. between. Honestly, you learn so much on this channel, not just hunting, not just hunting coins, mm -hmm. not just looking for rare and valuable 50 pences, you learn Latin or whatever it is or whatever, wow. it, uh, whatever it comes from. More importantly, Gibraltar. Walter has got two episodes left to help us fill our book because there's this episode, there's the next episode before this book is closed for good. Two years in the making, we still need the Kew Gardens, but of course we need we need the football. We've got two episodes to try and fill it because regardless, come January 2022, we are opening our new books and here they are, ready to go. And we've got some inserts from the lovely... Katie Jones as well. Mm, so they're all in. Ready to go, Lady M. Look at them. There's your book. Awesome. This is my book, the White Album. And I've got my face on the back of them. So they're, they're pretty cool, aren't they? So a big oh. thanks to, to Katie Jones. So January, yep. we're going to have a book each and we're going to see who can get the most coins in 2022. Mm -hmm. uh, as well as, well, the most coins, the fullest album. Yes. That's what it's and an ultimate year-long Benjamin Bunny challenge as well. Mm -hmm. I tell you what, let's, while we're talking about cake, let's go through a couple of, we've still got a couple of Christmas cards that we needed to show people. Before we get into this, so do, do stay tuned, we will go through 550 pences to try and find the last ones we, we need. But just want to do the uh, the last of the Christmas cards that we got. So look at this one, Lady M, one of your favourite characters awesome. on there. Cool, Winnie the Pooh. And look yeah. at uh, look oh, at this as well. Cute. Can't beat it, a little bit of extra effort, can you? A okay. little bit of extra stickers on there. They are pretty cool. And this is, uh, it's from Angela, this one looks like she's got a Aww. couple of doggies on there. Tis the season to be jolly. Two Bungle, Lady M, Ellie, Tech Guy and Harry. So everybody's the whole tribe's yeah. got a, a, a mention there. Wishing you a very Merry Christmas and all the best of the new year from Angela and family. So really appreciate that, Angela. Thanks for all the support you've given us this yeah. year. And, well, given us all the time. We've had loads yeah. of postcards and things from you. Mr. Poochiton got a lovely Christmas present, didn't he? He did, yes. So that's very kind of you. Thank you. And this one, Merry Christmas. This is from the lovely Katie Jones. I've kept these as well. This is what the inserts came in. So I've kept them. I do I do like keeping um, bits of tat, you know, for bit of mementos and bits things like that. that. Well, yeah, well, that. well, it's just an envelope, isn't it? But yeah. I, I like it. I keep it. Uh, two, Bingle, Lady M, Sir Poochie, Tech Guy and Ellie, wishing you a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year from Katie. Um... Jerry and Loki. Jerry and Loki. I couldn't read that for a second. I, I, I know them names as well. Mm -hmm. Hi, Bing and Lady M. Here are the new sets of inserts. Hope you're happy with them. We are. Good luck with the hunts in the new year. Hope to see you again soon. So now we do. But yeah, Katie very kindly has uh, offered to make us them. And uh, they're, they're, they're real good quality as well, aren't they? Yeah, awesome. The, they're laminated. You know? Yeah. Last, last forever them, I think. Yeah. Oh, and I'll tell you what, while, while we're opening things, a mini P.O. Box episode. I, I didn't show. I've had this a little while and I found it in the drawer while I was... Um, Sorting out the um, sorry, I slipped in the laughter there. You did. While I was uh, any no scratch cards unfortunately. While I was sorting out the drawer, the uh, the man drawers we call it, filing some stuff. I forgot I got this, got this for for face value. Right. Westminster, is that right? Westminster, not Minister. Yes. Westminster. Yes. Change checker. We're doing an offer where you could get oh, this five pound nice. coin for how much, Lady M? Uh, five pounds. Five pounds, <laughs> including postage. Wow. And our class is that. Lovely. We will remember them. Five pound coin. 100 years. Look at that. Super. Jersey, 2020. Great quality, that one. And I just love it. Yeah. Bit of, bit of colour on there. Mm -hmm. Nice and chunky. I'm not a, fa I'm not a five pound lover, but uh, this one is pretty, pretty cool. So yeah, I've got that one. Get that squirreled away into the collection. Right, I've talked enough. Little say, little mini. Oh, the camera's gone yeah. off as well. Little mini P.O. Box episode. Let's get in there. Let's just give, uh, let, let you Walter. And then do a little bit of a jiggle while you're opening that up. Come on. There we go. <laughs> that was just a little jiggle off there. Uh, Walter there to hopefully bring us the luck to get that football we need to finish the album. I did say that I was going to the bitter end with that album, didn't I? Mm -hmm. But it's over two years ago and I just wanted to do something different and have that year long Benjamin Bunny and our own albums again. So I'm just gonna have to find football in this episode or the next one. They had a couple of questions about the, ah, oh, there's Brexit. A couple of questions about how they're gonna work. The the uh, 
the, the books. So basically, we'll be doing two hunts a week. And on one episode, it will be your book. So we'll be hunting together, doing out, doing this as we normally do. Yeah. Hunting together. But one episode will be your book. And then the next episode will be my book. And we'll go on we'll go on like that. All the Benjamin bunnies are going in the pig or the money box. Let's see who finds the most over the course of the uh, the series. I will probably maybe do the Benjamin Bunny challenge. And whoever wins the challenge, maybe that might work. So if you win the challenge, it goes into your pig or money box. So whoever gets the most over the year, so whoever the most oh, wins. Yeah, right, okay. I think that's, that's how it'll work. Nice. I've got a Christopher Ryan inside. So nothing too valuable. You might argue that Paddington at the station is worth a quid. Mm -hmm. it's, in, uh, it's in nice condition. Mintage is just over five million. So not particularly rare or scarce. It will be in 20 years time. It'll be like the EEC stars and the, the NHS is now. Mm. Only it'll be, it'll be more and more scarce as time goes on, but we, we don't keep it. I've got a few stashed, but I don't, uh, I don't keep them. Here's another one I don't keep. This is Victoria Cross the medals, 2006 version. Well, I've got a, it's it's steamed up in the magic studio, mm. and it's because I've got a sweat on because I've done nothing all day yeah, other than, than lay on the settee and stink and eat. So, oops, so I've been pretty sweaty and pretty hot. So, I've steamed up the magic studio as we get a, 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 a peeper lack there. So, yeah, you're chilly. But, oh, this is a this is a beauty. We found one of these not that long ago. I oh, nice. I wonder if it was in the same the same batch. You know the same batch of coins. I didn't mm -hmm. look at the date on the bag, but I did get them at the same time. Mm -hmm. It is Olympic Taekwondo. This would have been like what a night. What if this had been the, the start of our new book? This would have been a great yeah. start, wouldn't it? But Eight, it's not. Eighth of December. Twenty one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's a similar date to uh, the the last Taekwondo we found. So a big shout out to Master Master Dan Temple. The uh, and if you didn't know as well, Master Dan starting his new painting channel. He's He's taking his paintings off his Master Temple's Treasures page and he's starting his own. So uh, it's own dedicated uh, painting. Do for Dangler. So do get over there and do that because Master Temple is not only a fantastic friend, a great guy. He does some great stuff. He even started doing coin hunts. I don't know whether we've seen him yet. I, I've, I, don't, I don't know whether he's published them yet. I had a little bit of a sneak peek. Not of his finds, but of a bag. <laughs> Haven't we? Talented man. We've seen a picture of a 50p bag, I think it was. Yes. He's going to start doing coin hunts to get over there. Is it Painting with the Master, I think, is his new channel. Uh, there we go, second one for Paddington Corner, Paddington at the Tower. I found a Benjamin Bunny there, Lady M, so mm -hmm. whoever wins this Benjamin Bunny challenge and the next Benjamin Bunny challenge will get to sign them. It will go in circulation, but from January, we will be stashing them for the greatest Benjamin challenge, Benjamin Bunny challenge are you've you, ever seen are you going to pick them? in all your born days. So there is a Taylor Peter Abbott. I am, and I'm going to tell you that in this hunt, we're going to find five. We're finding five Benjamin Bunnies. I'm going with three. And I'll tell you what we will have to do as well, because we're doing a year long Benjamin Bunny challenge. There's a the Scouts. Mm -hmm. Shout out to Pocket Rocket there. Um, because we're doing a year long Benjamin Bunny challenge, we're going to have to be clear on the rules. So there'll be none of this tomfoolery, this trickery. No, from you. There's another one. From your good self. Everyone thinks it's me that wants to win, but really we know it's you. There's Paddington at the uh, Paddington at the palace there waving his flags. So we've completed the corner. Wow. Paddington corner is complete. Super. That's nice, isn't it? Yes. It's always nice, that. And if we get the the Jeremy Toad boy and, uh, and uh, Tom Kitten, we'll complete the 2000 and... 17 set down that left hand side. If you get scouts, you might go a little mini set. I do like a good mini set. So yes, we'll have to be quite clear on the rules. So I like the idea of it being an actual, not just like whatever you find goes in. We still do the who's going to win. A Brexit set. A little mini set there, the two 2020 coins. So not... Uh, so yeah, I still think we need that element of challenge. So you still need to win the challenge. So, so we'll pretend this could be a dry run. Right, so let's let me think this truth through to see how best I can work this to my advantage. Right. I mean, to you know what I'm saying. There's another diversity, over ten million of them. So many, so many of them. Right. So what are we doing? 
regards busting or Same not. Because we will have to maintain the integrity of the channel. There's a, a rusty, rusty Britannia there. I think they're there. Mm. Oh no, it's just red. Is it just the red cray paint? The crayon or something. Yeah, I think it's just red paint. I'm keeping that. It's going to be a little bit different. So, what is your, so seriously, what is your opinion on the bust rule? Is there a bust rule or not? Cogs were around in your yeah. mind. So basically, the bust rule comes in or not. Because it's, it's the closest, isn't it? Well, you, yeah. you want to be bang on or the closest to the number. So, yeah, so you can't really have a bust rule because otherwise they won't go. Cow oh, guides, mini set complete the, with scouts. Uh, I think there's some other. Paddington at the palace, where we need flags. Um, so I think it's just whoever is closest. So, so the the bus drill doesn't exist. So if I, so how many did I say? Five. And you have to actually achieve Ooh, that now, number because oh, say, now you're adding. say you said five and I said three and there was only four, who's closest? We'll come back to that in a minute. So you have to actually achieve the amount that you say or more. Right, one, one step at a time. We'll come back to that in a minute. So let's talk about the closest, right? Because the bust rule came in because of you the... You were making things up. Right, so let, so let me... So, no. <laughs> right, so how many of you said in this? Three. Yeah, three, right. Mm -hmm. And I said five. Yeah. So if we got... 19 Benjamin Bunny's hard win because I was yeah. the closest. So you feel comfortable with that? Yeah. Oh, there's two and 17 shield. Because that... Mm, right. Because we, we have to have a winner, don't we, I yeah. suppose? And I guess you factor that in, don't you? Yes. When you make your guess. So there's no maximum or minimum number of bunnies. Just whoever is the closest. Yeah. Right, well, the way to... And if there's no bus rule, so so the way of doing it then, the way the way we would do it is it's when it's in the middle, isn't it? Yeah. So we either do as you say, you have to achieve that number. So yeah. say it was So say I say five and you say three and we get four. It's right in the middle, you say because you have to get there. So we could either do that mm -hmm. or we could say that you guess you, you you've got to but you can't have your guess guess that close. You've got to you've got to leave it so that you will get a winner. Is this Beatrix Potter anniversary coin? The keeper for me that. Yeah, put that down there. So if I said five, you wouldn't be able to say three, for example. Oh nice. Well, imagine the EEC stars. EEC stars, yep. Also that down there. So yeah, you no, because that's that's not fair. Because then no, is it? Because it's whoever finds the first bunny gets to decide who guesses first as well. So there's an element of trepidation. I know what you're saying. Like I'm just throwing this around. I'm not saying it's definitely definitely the way. He's another Benji. Oh, well done. <laughs> Excellent. Oh. <laughs> A little bit weak today. Well, you could have clearly, pulled me. I clearly pulled the bag too hard. Lady Hulk, there's <laughs> a uh, there's yeah. another Victoria Cross One, this two, time. Three, it's heroic four, axe. Five, six, seven, so eight, that's a, that's the mini set done. One one went down there. It's only Britannia though. Yeah, one of your seventeen though. All oh, right. Oh, eighteen. That one. Nineteen. Uh, nineteen. 20, and then one, yeah, on, the one floor. on the floor. Right. Thank you. I had a little mini set there with heroic axe going with uh, with medals. Diversity. Yeah, okay, so you've actually got to achieve it. So there's a bit of strategy. Yeah. By, the, um, by that token, though, what if nobody achieves it? So if I said five and you said four and it was only two, you get it because it's the closest. Yeah. 
So you only have to achieve it in the event of a draw. That it's, so you only have to achieve it in the event of it being in the middle of them. But you could just do it so you just can't have it so you can't be in the middle. Oh, you've got to... Isn't it? So if I said five, work? well, if I said five, you wouldn't be able to guess uh, three. Because you've left one in the middle. There's another Christopher Einstein. Yeah, but I could still say ten. Yeah, and you can't have anything in between, can you? Can't have an in, in between number. If it was, if I said five and it was six or seven, I'd win. Oh no, no. it could be an eight. Because you, you've got to achieve it. You've got to achieve the total. Okay. Well, let me know what you think in the comments, everybody, about what that should be. So we're basically saying no bust rule. So you can bust. Nothing busting doesn't matter. And. So there's no bust, there's no minimum, there's no maximum. You've just got to be the closest. And if it's bang in the middle, so the guess is right in the middle, it's the person who's achieved it. You have to achieve the score. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. I kind of feel as though you're just trying to flummox me there. Like, oh, there's Toad Boy, Jeremy. What do you mean? Jeremy Toad, I don't know. Just that you'll be like clever enough to work that out. We're going to need Tom Kit now. We've got that 2017 set. Okay, so what what do, what do we think? Or any other suggestions? Don't make them too complicated. There's another Brexit. So for the 2022 Benjamin Bunny Challenge. I don't want them writing down. Well. Yeah, I will. I'll write them down. So it's the closest. Bust. You can bust. Busting doesn't come into it. And if it's a draw, so if the actual number is right plumb in the middle of the two, it's the person who's achieved the score. So the low, the lower number, I guess. Yeah. Did we find the people act before? Is that? Uh, what did you make of them coins um, that we saw today, Lady M? So today we got a, uh, it was through the a Facebook group, the, the UK Coin Corner Coins Notes and Precious Metals, I think it's called, a Facebook group. They, uh, they put a picture up of leaked 2022 coins. They're going to be the annual set. Oh my word. There's Paddington at the Cathedral. Again, what did you think? Uh, yes. Them. If anyone hasn't seen them, I'm not saying it's absolutely definite because I don't know, but I did post it on, on our Bungle Collects Coins Facebook page and on our Instagram, Bungle underscore Collects, and on Twitter as well, at Bungle Coins. So do um, do check them out and let us know which one you think is your favourite. I like the telephone one, I think. Yeah. But, um, I think... I'd, I mean, I like the 71. Yeah, I like that. I hope it goes into the circulation yeah. for the Queen's uh, is it Platinum Jubilee. Yes. So check that out. I oh, also forget to say a subscribe as well. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video and all the rest right. of it. Just right? We're done. Let's uh, review. Right, so we're reviewing the Benjamin Bunny. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I said five, you said three. So this is bang in the middle, yeah. like you like you mm -hmm. said. So if this had been the new rules, so if this had been January onwards, would you would have won because you've achieved it. Yeah. As it happens, we're still in the in the in the normal rules. Oh. Fair, you did say January. So you have bust, I'm afraid. Okay. Um, so I win. Right. So I'm going to get to, right, bungle on there, put them back into circulation. Mm -hmm. So keep an eye out for them. There won't be there won't be any going in in 2022. We might do it right at the end because we'll be keeping them all, won't we? Yeah. Oh, that's the other thing about the Benjamin Bunny Challenge as well. So so, so I've won the, oh, right. So in January, I said five, you said three, you achieved it. So you would have won them four. So them four go in your pot. Yes. All four go in mm -hmm. your pot. So if you win the episode, you win the bunnies, they go in. So it's not just how many you find, it's how many mm -hmm. yeah. you've won. Yeah? So three of them go in my pot. No, no, no you've won the episodes, so you get all four. Yeah. So at the end of the year, it's it's how many you've won. Isn't it? How many, not, just ep, not just number of episodes. It's how many how many coins you've won in the episode. So I might win three episodes in a row, but only get one coin. Okay. Each and only put three in, but you might win one episode and get seven. Right. So yeah. it adds a little bit of extra, a little bit of extra jazz in it, I think, don't you? <laughs> so anyway, I think we've sorted that. Do you want to write that down? You'd make a good secretary with your glasses and your bangs. Right, thanks. You look, you look no. good. And I've seen, especially when you wear that like secretary out, not outfit, nothing like that. I don't mean that. That, <laughs> that like, like you go to school, that kind of like grey skirt, white t shirt, white shirty thing. Right. Like a school mistress with your, with your rose glasses on. Anyway, I'm digressing, aren't I? Better talk right. about the plum find. Right. Clearly this. So a big shout out to our mate, Mr. Dan Temple. 
go and check out Master Temple's treasures and painting with the master. Now we'll get squirreled away into my collection. We've got an honourable mention for the EEC stars. So just over 5 million of them were minted. About a quid's worth maybe. So I'll keep hold of that one. This one, you might be lucky to get a pound. Less than, uh, well, is it five? 6.9 million, I think, of these circulated. So they're quite quite highly minted, but I'll keep them. And I'm just going to keep that as a bit of an oddity because it's got some red paint on it. It's just like four, it's another 400 odd million of them circulated, but hey ho, nothing exciting. I suppose you can mention Benjamin Britten as well. That's fat, like 5.3 million. Mm -hmm. That could do, I, I keep a few of them, not many. Uh, is that what else? I don't think so. No, I think we're done. Yeah. Right. Only one more, whoop, hang on. <laughs> Only one more episode to go. Before we close the before we close the book forever, um, I did have some suggestions for thumbnails, but I can't remember what the word. Didn't write them down, right. so we're gonna do a um, we're gonna we're gonna do a we're gonna put Walter in. I think we'll put Walt put Walter in the camera, right? And hopefully he's gonna give us because he's given some decent look, some decent Olympic look. So there's Walter, and then do you wanna? I'll do Walter for me, and then you 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 pull a face to say Walter, do the business. Go on. I'm gonna put this again. Uh, no, I don't put the plum in. I put oh. one. I put a potential plum in, don't I? Right. So you use one of the one of the honourable mentions. And obviously, you need to cover the actual. I would have forgotten that as well. You need to cover the actual coin. So go on then. You you tell Walter that next time we want we want football. One episode left for Walter. Go on, tell him. Come on, Walter. You've got to do this. We need football. Is that your thumbnail? Like pull a, like pull a, oh. do an expression as though you told him. Oh right, sorry, I thought you meant just like physically tell him. Well yeah, you do yeah. Right, it's, okay. It's, it's not real. It's not real, it's plastic. Right. Hey. Right, go on. You've just totally go on. Do it. Nice. Right? Okay, we're all done. Tune in. Thursday, just two days time, you'll see the last ever 50p episode. Hang on, no, I need to get this stopped. Right, thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Don't forget to subscribe.